people in Canada. I'm sure that they are connected right now. And so let's release our faith within a few minutes. We're a family of faith. You don't have to be plagued with that sickness, terminal diseases of all sorts, and then particularly this devil of cancer. In one minute, I'd like you to pray for yourself or for everyone you know. Ay, 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 ay. Glory be to God. Ay, 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 ay. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Pray. Glory be to God. Ay, 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 ay. Glory be to God. In the name of Jesus Christ, you have granted us your grace and your power to heal the sick and to rewrite the stories in the lives of your people. I stretch my hands right now in this auditorium and across the airwaves. In the name of Jesus, anyone under the sound of my voice who is a victim of terminal disease, cancer, all kinds of blood conditions, failed organs, already left for dead, by the power that raised Christ from the dead, I decree this moment that the spirit influences behind those conditions, I curse them right now in Jesus' name. I curse them right now in Jesus' name. I curse them right now in Jesus' name. Right now I decree and declare, be healed. Be healed, liver, be healed. Kidneys, be healed. Heart, be healed. Blood be cleansed. Brain tumors be healed. Prostrate cancer be healed. Leukemia be healed. Organ failures of any and all sorts may they jack back to life now. We reverse stage 4 cancer. We reverse stage 3 cancer. In the name of Jesus Christ. And I stretch both my hands and decree and declare that this moment, every pain, every discomfort, let it give way as a sign that the healing power has rested upon them. In the name of Jesus Christ. And as I pray for them, I'm stirred to pray for restoration. Because when things happen like this, people lose money, they lose their joy. In the name of Jesus, I decree and declare, let the restorer restore. Let the restorer restore. Let the restorer restore. Let the restorer restore. In the name of Jesus Christ. And we declare that so shall it be to the glory of the name of Jesus. Amen and amen. Let me ask you to pray one more time. Mention one area of your life that you are trusting God to visit even tonight. Go ahead. I'm releasing my faith with you. Don't be silent. Pray and let the God of wonder surprise you tonight. You came to church. Go ahead and pray. One area by faith that you know you are trusting God to come through for you. Release your faith. Someone pray. Ay, 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 glory be to God. Ay, 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 glory be to God. Are you praying? Ay, 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 glory be to God. Ay, 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 glory be to God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, glory be to God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, glory be to God. Ay, 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 glory be to God. Ay, 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 glory be to God. Ay, 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 glory be to God. 
mighty name we have prayed as you have declared in the name of Jesus let it be turned to your answer I say it again as you have declared before the Lord may it be turned to your answer a speedy answer for that in the name of Jesus let me just tell you a word or two and then you sit down you see prophetic declarations are very powerful they are powerful because every time a prophetic word that is truly backed by the anointing is sent forth. I have taught you what happens is that the spirit of wisdom follows that word. The assignment of the spirit of wisdom is to arrange the human actors that will make that word come to pass. Are we together? Yeah. So when a prophetic word goes forth, the dynamics of its operation is that in the realm of the spirit, the Holy Spirit manifests over that word as the spirit of wisdom. And he begins to bring together the human actors. Why? Because human beings are beings, moral agents with a will. Are we together? So for instance, if it is a word of breakthrough, the spirit of the living God begins to find available vessels. Now they have a right to reject him. So God can prompt it in the heart of a destiny helper to help you in line with that word. The destiny helper can refuse. God will honor them. But I can tell you out of the 8 billion people, there are enough people. Somebody will say yes. You now see why the prophetic words are powerful. So that declaration comes upon you. You can't see it. You can't feel it. You just receive by faith and say amen. But when you say amen, your own part is done. But it's important for you to know what happens in the realm of the spirit. The spirit of wisdom kicks into motion immediately. And the assignment of the spirit of wisdom is to bring together all the human actors that must make that word come to pass provided the prophetic word came with God's backing and it was received upon a heart that was full of faith you see that now because the way God designed it is that the moment his word accomplishes what he has said it returns to him as proof that the word is finished you see so the moment the word has not returned back it means it is still working there is something it could be difficulty in terms of putting together human actors, but for sure it will find someone. That is the reason to you, it will be a series of coincidences. A word just came and someone just gave me an employment. No, someone did not just give you an employment. A word came and then I have a baby. No, you did not just have a baby. The moment the word of God comes forth, the Holy Spirit has the unique ministry of confirming the speakings of God even through the lips of his servants can I speak over you one more time in the name of Jesus Christ I decree and declare in this season may God so distinguish your life in this season may my God so distinguish your life your life will serve as an example for many that God lifts men your life will serve as an example for many that the Spirit of God can birth glory out of the lives of men. Receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Please be seated. God bless you.